What's good, what's good, and welcome back to Investing with Jax. We're going to be talking about chilies, guys. If you get any value out of this video, it goes a long way. If you smash that like button, subscribe, and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on chili. I try to get to as many comments as I can. So we've had a nice little juicy gain over the last day of 13%. On the week, um, we're up 9% as Ethereum's been recovering. Uh, many of the coins have been recovering too. So we're um, up 9% on the month. But in this last day, we're starting to see a little bit of light from Chili's. I love Chili's, one of my favorite coins and companies as I'm a big sports fan. So uh, current market cap, 3.22 billion. Guys, we're gonna go into the Twitter as well as the technical analysis and some price targets for Chili's. 24 hour volume, 1.36 billion. Uh, circulating supply of 5.59 billion coins of Chili's. All right, guys. So, Chili's powers socios.com. It aims to give sports and esports fans the ability to crowd manage their favorite teams, games, leagues, and events. Um, super cool what, what they're doing. You can buy your team's token, and that gives you the right to vote on certain things like jerseys and, and stadium events. So it's pretty sweet. I got a little bit of a cow leg. All right, fixed it. So let's hop over to their Twitter, guys. So uh, we have a little video here from Alexander Dreyfus, which is the, the CEO of Chile. So I'm just going to play it for you guys so you guys can check it out. It's, it's not very long. Hey, Chilizen. Uh, I'm in Madrid right now. I'm actually visiting the office that we can take and build our second headquarter in Europe. Uh, you can see the view here. It's very cool. And here we're going to have a lot of sports marketing uh, talents, uh, a lot of business development teams that's going to take care of um, Spain, uh, Latin America, and the rest of Europe in general. Um, and that's going to be the second office after the office we have in Malta, where we have now almost 70 people. As I said, we are like 110 now in the company, we're gonna be 200, and that office is gonna be a, a big one. So, a lot of good stuff happening for chilisandsocials.com, and uh, thank you very much for your support. See you soon. <laughs> oh, let me, <laughs> excuse me. <clears throat> My apologies, how rude. Um, so that's pretty cool to see they're opening a new office in Madrid um, to handle their business in Spain. So I love to see that. You know, you love to see the company progressing as well as words from uh, the owners of the companies. All right, guys. So let's pop over to the technical analysis for Chili's. So we're here on the four hour chart, guys, and this is beautiful. So what we're seeing here is the 20 EMA has, has done a bullish cross over the 50 and over the 200, and we're starting to trend upwards. This is very bullish, guys. This is exactly what we want to see so what i want to see is that we start to go along this trend line create higher highs higher lows higher highs higher lows and we can go take out this high at about 84 cents um for chilies all right guys so i'm going to quickly take out the fibonacci to give you guys some price targets so you take it from the high uh down to the low and we can see we're having a little bit of support and resistance here at 58 cents. So quickly give you guys that. Um, so what we'd like to see is we create um, some support. Maybe we burst through the 57 cents. We create support. We create a higher high, a higher low, and we can start trending uh, towards these price targets of 72 cents. And then we have that high all right guys that high of 83 cents and then if we're able to break that we can go up and try to tackle 94 cents all depends on ethereum guys chilies is a part of the ethereum blockchain and we can see here on the chart for ethereum just one moment a little bit of patience I already had it open but uh, you can see we're on a nice little pump here Oh, come on, bro. Um, with Ethereum, so hopefully we see a little bit of rollover because we need that to continue a healthy chart um, and continue upwards. And hopefully we see this market correction. Depends on BTC. Um, I did talk about BTC coming back to the 20 EMA, and it has done that. Maybe I'll pull that up for you guys as well. Just a little bit of patience, guys. Hope you're well. Hope the family is healthy. Hope your pets are full of life. And, you know, if they're getting old, well, give them as much love as you can because uh, they've done some wonderful comforting uh, with you and your life. And why? Why? Why does the chart have to look like this? 
Uh, maybe I can see it on the one day. I don't know what it is with the BTC chart. Jeez, bro. Come on. All right, guys. I'm going to pull it up on Binance. I apologize for the delay. Uh, usually, I have this stuff ready, but I wasn't expecting to pull up the BTC chart here. So, uh, as I was saying, um, show your pets some love because uh, they've been showing you love and they deserve uh, your attention. So, <laughs> a little bit of small talk here while I pull up the BTC chart on the one day. Yabba dabba doo. Okay, where's my 20? Or on the one week, actually. Yeah, so we're here on the one week um, for, for BTC. And I talked about it having it catch back up to the 20 EMA. And we're starting to see that. Um, so if we can kind of consolidate and the 20 EMA catches up, that would be beautiful. That would be a sign that we will continue this uptrend. We'll continue this uptrend. Um, but there could also possibly be a little bit of sell-off while, while we find the 20 EMA um, for BTC. So let's get back into Chili's here. Yeah, so hopefully I would like to see us go along that trend line and make higher highs and higher lows and start to um, break through these price targets of 57 cents. We're currently sitting there right now, 72 cents, and then we can head to that high of 83 cents. And if the bull run continues, if this is our recovery, remember guys, there can always be more correction um, with BTC. But if this is our recovery, then we're looking for our next price target, if we break that high for Chili's at, um, let me get out my little price target. If we can break the high of 94 cents, well, our next price target for Chili's would be up here at $1.32 um, when the bull run starts to continue, all right, guys? So hopefully we continue along this trend line. Um, Ethereum stays strong and doesn't correct further, and we start to continue along this bull run. Uh, so our price targets are 72. Whoa, get back up there. Uh, 71 cents if we're able to break through. Even here, we, if we're able to break through uh, 63 cents, uh, currently we're sitting at 57, then we could start heading towards 71 um, but the chart is looking healthy. I love to see the bullish cross with the with the EMAs, with the 20 EMA uh, coming over the 50 and the 200. So things are looking good for Chili's, one of my favorite coins and companies overall as I love sports. So um, shout out to you guys. Thank you so much for the support. I believe we're at like 17K. If I go to my YouTube analytics. Yeah, we're here at 17K, over 17K. So thank you guys so much for, for the ongoing support on the channel. I really appreciate it. I, I'm glad you guys enjoy the videos. And if you enjoyed this one, smash that like button, subscribe. Turn on notifications if you're new. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter. Check out the Discord, Patreon link in the bio. And uh, let me know your thoughts on Chili's. Are you a fan? Um, what's your favorite team? Uh, what's your favorite thing about Chili's? And uh, let me know your thoughts. All right. Peace. Much love. Take care. Mm -hmm.